Priya second generation red triangle warning. Code P3000 and POA80. If your Toyota Prius shows the red triangle warning and codes P300A and POA80, it means there's an issue with the hybrid battery system. P3000 means a problem with the battery control system. POA80 means the hybrid battery is failing and needs replacement. Why does this happen? 1. Battery degradation. Over time, battery cells wear out especially after 150,000 plus miles. 2. Voltage imbalance. Weak battery cells create voltage differences, triggering errors. 3. Cooling system issues. A dirty or clogged cooling fan can overheat the battery. 4. Long inactivity. If the car is not driven regularly, battery cells weaken faster. 5. Faulty battery. ECU or wiring corrosion can cause false readings. What can you do? Check battery health. Use an OBD2 scanner like TechStream to check cell voltages. Clean the battery cooling fan. It's behind the rear passenger seat or trunk area. Battery reconditioning. Replace weak modules. But this is a temporary fix. Replace the hybrid battery. Best long-term solution for a reliable drive. Step 1. Get an OBD2 scanner. You need a BLUETOOTH or Wi-Fi OBD2 scanner that supports hybrid battery diagnostics. Recommended VPKOB check BLE, Panlong, or Carista. Step 2. Plug in the OBD2 scanner. 1. Locate the OBD2 port. It's under the dashboard near the driver's left knee. 2. Insert the OBD2 scanner into the port. It should power on automatically. 3. Turn the car to ready mode. Press the power button with your foot on the brake until the ready light appears. Step 3. Connect to Dr. Prius app. 1. Install the Dr. Prius app. Download from the Google Play Store or Apple App Store. 2. Turn on B-L-U-E-T-O-O-T-H for Bluetooth OBD2 or W-I-F-I for Wi-Fi OBD2 on your phone. 3. Open Dr. Prius app and go to settings greater than select OBD2 adapter. 4. Choose your OBD2 scanner from the list. 5. Tap connect. The app will establish a connection. Step 4. Check battery monitor. 1. In the Dr. Prius app, tap live battery monitor. 2. Look at the voltage readings for each battery block. Normal voltage, 6.5 volts, 8.5 volts per block. If one block is 0.3 volts lower than others, it's weak. 3. Check battery temperature. If it's too high, clean the battery cooling fan. Step 5. Clear the error code. 1. Go to Dr. Prius app greater than OBD2 functions, greater than clear error codes. 2. Confirm the reset. 3. The red triangle should disappear if the issue is temporary. 4. Restart the car and check if the error comes back. Important notes. If the error returns quickly, the battery is failing and needs reconditioning or replacement. If it stays off, the issue may have been minor, like a loose connection or overheating. Cleaning the cooling fan can help prevent overheating issues. Step 6. Disconnect and remove the OBD2 scanner. Once you've finished checking the battery and clearing the error codes, it's important to properly disconnect and remove the OBD2 scanner. 1. Close the Dr. Prius app. This stops the connection to the OBD2 scanner. To turn off the Prius, press the power button to shut down the car. 3. Unplug the OBD2 scanner. Gently pull it out from the OBD2 port under the dashboard. 4. Store it safely. Keep it in your car if you use it regularly or store it in a dry place. Warning! Never leave the OBD2 scanner plugged in permanently as it may drain the 12 volts battery over time. Now you're all set. Let me know if you need more help.